Is sugar a sweet trap or a silent killer lurking in our pantries? We're constantly bombarded with sugary treats, Some but what's the real cost to our health and well-being? Today, we're diving sheets. deep into the science behind sugar's Some impact on the brain and body. Is it merely a harmless like indulgence, or does it possess addictive but properties similar to those of drugs? The debate no, rages on. Sugar versus friend. cocaine, no, no, sugar versus me. insulin. We'll explore the evidence and uncover the shocking truth about sugar's addictive potential. What exactly constitutes an addiction? It's more than just liking something a lot. Addiction is characterized by specific criteria, including binging, withdrawal, and craving. Binging refers to the uncontrolled consumption of large amounts of a substance. Withdrawal involves experiencing negative physical or psychological symptoms upon cessation. Craving and relapse represent a psychological compulsion that overrides logic and willpower. How does sugar consumption relate to these addictive behaviors? Let's examine the evidence. Sugar triggers the release of dopamine in the brain, a neurotransmitter associated with pleasure and reward. This dopamine release occurs specifically in the nucleus accumbens, a key area in the brain's reward system. Interestingly, the nucleus accumbens is also activated by alcohol and cocaine. This shared pathway raises serious questions about sugar's potential for addiction. Repeated stimulation of the reward system by sugar can lead to tolerance. This means that over time, you need more sugar to achieve the same level of pleasure. In today's sugar-soaked world, our reward systems are constantly being hijacked. This constant bombardment can have serious consequences for our health and well-being. A groundbreaking 2007 study conducted in Bordeaux, France, shed light on sugar's addictive potential. Researchers gave rats a choice between sugar, water and cocaine. The results were astonishing. 94% of the rats overwhelmingly chose sugar, water over cocaine. This suggests that sugar can be even more rewarding than a highly addictive drug. The study also revealed that sugar rewires behavior, not just preference. The rats exhibited compulsive sugar-seeking behavior, even when faced with negative consequences. Furthermore, the rats showed withdrawal symptoms when sugar was removed from their diet. These symptoms included anxiety, teeth chattering, and changes in brain chemistry. FMRI scans have confirmed that sugary foods activate the same reward centers in the human brain as drug use. This provides further evidence that sugar can have addictive effects.